It's game six of the Western Ontario Super Hockey League semifinal matchup between the Tilsonburg Thunder and the Tilbury Bluebirds. The Thunder able to rally on the road and force game six on home ice on Sunday afternoon. The Bluebirds looking to clean up the series and avoid a winner take all game seven on Tuesday. The pair battling for a berth in the championships against the Stratford Fighting Irish. First period against the Thunder coming out flying on home ice. This is Mitch Fitzmorris in the opening minute. He gains the line and lets a clapper fly, and Fitzmorris rips it in. That's a great start for the Thunder, and they're in front early. Then it's Tilsonburg looking for more, but watch the Bluebirds netminder, Ryan Polidori. He reads the play and dives out with a great poke check to break up the chance. The Bluebirds back the other way here on the four check. Jesse Raymond pokes it away, but it's right to Mitchell Van Teeling in the slot. Jesse Raymond flailing on the ground, makes two fantastic saves, and it stays 1-0 Tilsonburg. Some good work from both netminders and the goaltending show would continue. Watch Ryan Polidori, he stones Matt Weston on the breakaway. Lay in the frame now and it's the Thunder breaking through on this play. Watch the trailer, Chris Knotts plays a low shot on net. Curtis Christo blasts it through the goal mesh. That's a big goal from Christo and it's 2-0 Thunder. The Bluebirds right back the other way, looking to fight back before the second. Here's Nick Tetro with some space on the wall. He snaps it on net, and it's off the post and in! That's a good snipe from Tetro, and the Bluebirds cut the Thunder's lead in half, heading to the second. In the second period now, Thunder power play, and it's a good setup for Jake Brown. He finds the puck back door, and he slams it home, restoring the two-goal lead for the Thunder. Tilbury power play now looking to answer. Braden Roberts loses his stick, so Vyacheslav Czech Grinsev has a wide open shot from the slot, and it's money from Vyacheslav. That goal makes it 3 2 Thunder, and the Bluebirds wouldn't stop there. Moments later now, and it's more from the Tilbury power play. Watch Austin Jennings for the setup. He plays it out front to Jeff Burridge, and Jeff's tip is perfect. That's the equalizer for Burridge, and we're all tied up at three each. Still in the second, the Bird's back on the power play, but look out for Mitch Brown. He steps ahead of the defense, but he's hooked down and awarded a penalty shot. On that penalty shot, Mitch Brown swings wide, cuts out front, and looks 5-hole, and he's got it! That's the go-ahead goal for Brown, and it's 4-3 Thunder. Head to the third period now and watch the Tilsonburg captain, Mike Rebury. He collects the puck and fires 5-hole, and Rebury's got another, so it's 5-3 Thunder. The Bluebirds not down and out yet, however, still fighting for the comeback, and here on another power play, Austin Jennings rips it off the wall. It's back on his tape, and he hammers it in! So the Bluebirds are once again within one. And later in the third, how about Michael McIntyre from the point? He rips it off the post and in! That ties the game up at 5-5, and this one's headed to overtime. Midway through the extra frame now, this is Andrew Tapsell on the near boards. He spots out Jake Brown flying in for the OT winner! It's a huge goal for Jake Brown and the Thunder as they keep the series alive and force game seven. Andrew Tapsell and Jake Brown coming up clutch in overtime and we're going the distance. Game seven is on Tuesday in Tilbury.